what's up guys and welcome back to another video right in our, on my youtube channel today i'm gonna basically tell you how to fix every kind of crashing lagging or freezing issue you're currently having with the forest so stick to the end guys this will be a step-by-step -step tutorial and in the end you will probably know what to do in order to fix this kind of issues before we start right into the video i just want you guys to know let you guys know that, that i would really really appreciate it if you would just leave a like a comment or a subscription right into my youtube channel it would really make my day and help me out as a little youtuber as i am Especially subscribing would be such a big support for me guys. You would support my work in YouTube a little bit and I'm gonna really really be thankful for that and I'm gonna thank you for that. So anyways, I would just say let's get right sorted. So the first step in order to fix this kind of issue is gonna be to open up your task manager by just simply navigating down to your taskbar or using your shortcuts. You're gonna right click your taskbar, open up your task manager. Once this one pops up, navigate to the top left corner. Sticking, you're and clicking onto processes, sticking around processes. Next step is going to be to, I know it's going to sound a little bit weird, but trust me guys, it will help you a lot. Just simply right click every single task, which has nothing to do with Windows and click onto end task. Let me explain that. So two reasons for that. First reason, too many applications running at the same time will cause your PC or your game to crash, to freeze or to lag because if especially in low end PCs, your PC can't handle that anymore. And the second reason, like it was for me, it is like that some applications, don't ask me why, is, are going to third party your game, causing it to crash or to freeze in some way. And uh, by just ending every single task, you're avoiding this issue. So just trust me, guys, and do that. And once you're finished, you should be able to enter the task manager again. Next up is going to be to search an empty spot or right onto your monitor. So we're going to right click and click into display settings. Next step is going to be to click into display. And once you click display, I want you to identify which your main monitor is. Obviously, this just applies if you have more than one monitor. Once you identified it, scroll down and stick around scale and layout. We want you to change the size of text apps and other items to 100% as recommended. And your display resolution should be the same as in games. So example, for example, if you have an in-game 1720 by 1070, I also want you to do this for your display resolution. Once you're finished, you should be able to end this task and navigate to the bottom left corner of your screen, opening up your settings navigating right into update and security and sticking around windows update and i know guys it's going to sound a little bit basic but trust me updating every single driver you could possibly update is going to help you really really good with your current issues and also with your crashing lagging or freezing issue so download the latest version of windows provide the best possible performance for your pc and once you did that, I want you to end this task and do the same thing for your graphics card. So download the latest version of that, download the latest driver and provide the best possible performance in general for your PC. That's it for the videos. Uh, uh, for the video, I hope that, could, that I could actually help you out of this one, guys. If it was like that, just leave a like, a comment or a subscription. I'm going to really be thankful for that. I'm really sorry if I couldn't help you, but I'm just going to do my best in order to help you out. Either way, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. See you at the next one and bye.